The researchers analyzed the brain sizes and diets of more than 140 species of primates comprising apes, monkeys, lemurs and loris and found that those who ate fruit instead of leaves had 25% more brain tissue, even when controlled by body size and species relationship. Take spider monkeys and howler monkeys, for example. They both live in the rainforests of South America in groups of 10. However, where the howler monkeys paused mask in the trumpet tree leaves all day, spider monkeys venture out in small groups shortly after the departure of the sun to feed on passion fruit and other ripe snacks. Despite their similar environments and social environment, spider monkeys have larger brains than howler monkeys. If you are looking for food and the hardest to access foods, such as fruit instead of leaves, then you need to have all the cognitive strategies to deal with that, a New York University PhD student and lead author of the study. Fruit can vary from season to season, be hidden in hard-to-reach corners, and require skill and strength to break in, smarter primates might be more likely to reach out and reap their nutritious fruits. All this is much more complicated than just grabbing a leaf and eating it. And so, a fruit diet can in turn have led to the evolution of larger brains over generations. Monkeys and apes that incorporated animal proteins into their diet also had a slightly larger brain than leaf eaters, the Nature of Ecology and Evolution study. Researchers again speculate that this may be because primates need more cognitive power to hunt and consume things like frogs, birds, insects and compared to the brain power they needed to eat leaves. But to find that these omnivores have brains considerably smaller than fruit eaters. They suspect it could be because many of these omnivores, such as lemurs and loris, eat insects. Insects can be as abundant as leaves and could be easy to catch. 